The 2016-2017 Butler basketball season was filled with some incredible moments here inside Hinkle Fieldhouse. In this week's episode of Inside Butler Basketball, connected by Smithville Fiber, we'll take a look back at some of those special moments. This week on Inside Butler Basketball, connected by Smithville Fiber, the Gigacity Company. The Bulldogs were picked sixth in the preseason Big East coaches poll, but quickly they proved they belong a lot closer to the top of that list. The team got out to an impressive 8-0 start, highlighted by Kamar Baldwin's game-winning shot against Northwestern and a big win against number eight Arizona in the Las Vegas Invitational Championship game. Butler finished off non-conference play with three very impressive victories, Cincinnati, Indiana, and Vermont, so they headed into conference play with an 11-1 record. Perhaps the most memorable moment of the year came on January 4th as Butler hosted the number one team in the country, Villanova. Led by balanced scoring from Andrew Shravis, Keith and Savage, and Keelan Martin, the Bulldogs took down the previously undefeated Wildcats as fans stormed the court in celebration. Despite a few bumps along the road, Butler had safely secured a spot in the NCAA tournament and was looking to bolster its resume for a high seed as the tournament grew closer. But the Dogs first had to go on the road to play Villanova and Xavier, both teams looking to avenge earlier losses to Butler here at Hinkle. But the Bulldogs were ready. Keelan Martin scored 22 points as the Bulldogs beat the Wildcats and stopped a 48-game winning streak at the Pavilion, the on-campus arena for Villanova. The Bulldogs swept the regular season against the Wildcats. Then the Bulldogs followed up with a road win at Xavier in Cincinnati. Butler finished the regular season with a record of 24-8 and, and earned a four seed in the NCAA tournament. Traveling to Milwaukee, Butler was matched up with 13 seed Winthrop in the first round and won 76 to 64, led by Avery Woodson's 18 points on 60% from beyond the arc. In the round of 32, they faced Middle Tennessee and won again, advancing to the second weekend of the tournament for the first time since 2011. After clinching a spot in the Sweet 16, the Bulldogs fell to the top seed North Carolina, which ended their season in Memphis. It was really a year full of incredible moments from you know beating the number one team in the country twice and uh, winning a pre-conference tournament to uh, the number of really special moments we had as a group. We're fortunate to be a part of a program that's used to tremendous success and a terrific basketball culture and hopefully we can continue it. Go Dogs! Well, thanks so much for following along all season long. The Bulldogs will get set over the summer, ready for another exciting season of Butler basketball. We'll see you back at Hinkle Fieldhouse next fall.